Hi everybody, my name is Keaton and welcome back to another episode of my Let's Play on The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild Master Mode. In the last episode, we made our way to Zora's Domain to meet Prince Sidon, King Dorfran, and Mizu about Mipha. We come to the Divine Beast Varuta, which you can't really see it. You can't really see her, but you can see the the the, the beam um, shooting at the Hyrule Castle. Uh, <clears throat> We rescue Mipha to have her become a spirit, so now there's only two more Divine Beasts left. And today, the next we're going to be taking on, uh, we're going to go up to the Volcano. Um, I don't think you can see the Divine Beast somewhere, um, but I know it walks somewhere on it. And that is what we're going to be uh, taking on today's episode. But before we do that, well... Yeah, before that, I was gonna say something else, but, um, let's see here, uh, yeah, I already got the Iron Sledgehammer. I wanna talk to Beetle. I wanna see, uh, let's see here, dude, what do you, okay. I, th I, I forgot how many arrows I have, but I'm gonna take a lot because I feel like I'm, I'm out of it. So, by the way, I got myself a Hero's Shield for, by using a Toon Zelda Amiibo. So now I have it for um, now I have a now I have a, a full Wind Waker set, like that's really awesome. Honestly, I'm glad I did that because now I feel like I want to do a Wind Waker Link style. Even though it can also be, um, oh, <clears throat> uh, he can also be like from Phantom Hourglass and Spirit Tracks. I have played um, Phantom Hourglass, but I have never finished it. I never played Spirit Tracks, but I but I'm not a fan of you know I don't know uh, drawing or writing something on an you know on the bottom screen with a stylus. Um, but uh, uh, actually, you know what? I don't think I need a pony. Oh no, hold on. Um, what I actually want here. How about Bored Epona? Because she's been out and I feel like she needs some good rests. I need to give her some care by having you guys Bored Epona while I'll do my own thing. Do, uh, what? let's say while doing my own thing with finding more shrines. I mean, I know, I, I know she can, I know she can be the easy one to use for, uh, what is it? Um. I know, I know she is pretty much easy to use for whatever something that's pretty far away, but, but still want to give her some time, give her like, you know, just want to give her relax before I do anything that's too much. <clears throat> so yeah, right now, um, like I mentioned, I would do that later for the shrine, but now after everything, uh, now I can go find a shrine, which I think it's somewhere. Yeah, I don't know. I'm I'm following um the the Shiga, or not Shiga, the shrine sensor. Hmm. Okay, not yeah. I think it's. Let's see. It's this way. I'm trying to remember where it is. All right. Just want to climb, just want to run up. <laughs> and yes, climb up too. Alright. I think, yes! There it is! I was looking for that. I found it. Yay! I'm so happy, glad I found that. Let's go in. Alright, so let's get started. For the passing the flame, so this is the so we're gonna have to do some flame stuff going on. I don't remember which uh, arrows I use, but I'll just use any random anyway. It's, excuse me, you got a hiccup. Oh yeah, I'm like if I remember correctly, <laughs> but the answer is it's right here. Oh my gosh, ow! I'm on fire. This boy is on fire. <laughs> Uh, don't mind with the parody. <clears throat> Alright, uh... Okay, let's be careful not to set ourselves on fire. Okay, there you go. I'll do the same thing for that. You know what? Yeah, do that. What? Okay, that's weird. I don't know what, but... 
There you go. Uh, where is it? Yeah, right here. Yeah, I would definitely set the box on fire. Oh yeah, there's a key. Good to know I already got burned. Like, the chest got burned because it's made of a wood. Oh, I can't grab- I can't grab it out through the, the cell. I have to grab it like that. So there you go, got a small key. Oh, hey, an opal. Okay, well I failed on that one. Oh, I could just go in there without having to burn up. Never mind. Cobble Crusher. Which, I won't be needing that, honestly. Let's see if they have anything in the chest. Now I just op open it. So this way right here we get is the ruby. Yes, we got a ruby. So, I think I should go back to, um... I should head back to the Foothill Stable because I think I need... Yeah, I should probably get more Elixir. I think I mentioned something that I want to get more Fireproof Elixir. I want to get more than just three. So I'll probably get another three to add number six. So I'll do that after this. Oh look, now you can see uh, Divine Beast Varuta there shooting the beam. Hmm. Alright, so I think there's another one that's from like the enemies, I will say. Yeah, don't worry, I'll get to that. Alright, good to know. Now I have like a kind of a three of a stamina right now. I can now use some stamina food that I have with me. Alright, where is it? I want to travel, but I'm pretty sure it's close. <clears throat> like, I see it over there. So, let's fly there. Whee! <clears throat> yeah, I think... Uh, yeah, I forgot where the enemy is. But... But anyways, you know, I just want to go ahead and get the... You know, I'll just go ahead and uh, get myself another fire purple elixir. So I can have more than less. So I'm coming up. Yeah, here I am. All right, where where is she? Yeah, there she is. Hey, you. Can I have another? Uh, yeah, I'll take another five purple elixir. Here's my 150 rupees. Now I have another one. Oh yeah, there's there's more at the Goron City, which is a good thing to hear and know about. Oh yes, I'll take the wood two wood. I'll even take the the sun shroom. That's a, that's actually really nice. Uh, oh yeah, I think you can see the divine beast up ahead, kind of. I don't know. Or am I just seeing? Oh wait, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying to. It's so hard to see when it's like far away from here. I I want to tell you this and say this. All right. All right. Let's get to climbing now, Link. So, oh, no, no, no. What are you doing? Keep going. So, yeah, there's, there's a Sheikah Tower right there. All right. Now I can collect more of these. Now I can mine things, whatever I want, which is great. And I just see a tail. That must be a chameleon. <clears throat> I think it's a chameleon divine beast. I'm sure they're called like Rudania. Divine beast Rudania. Oh goody, I found a Korok. Hi there. Alright. 
throw it away. Alright. <laughs> so this is gonna be confusing because when I see a lava Oh, here we go. Another shrine nearby. Uh where wait, which one? Right, it's this way. Alright. I should go ahead and put Majora's mask on because I feel like I'm gonna be heading towards to the enemies up ahead. Like I think it's the Lizabos and Bogoblins, something like that. So that's all. So that's why I want to do that. <clears throat> but yeah, it's pretty funny because when you look, because when you look at when you look at the lava, you could you can think that there's it's a shrine that you're heading to, but it's actually the lava. Which I feel like this might well, this might happen to me. I might oh it's a shrine, but no, it's actually just the lava. <laughs> In a funny way, if you ask me. And I did not ran I did not ran towards the enemy, which is good. All right then. So this one, this is the power of fire. Whoa. Oh no. <laughs> Well, it's okay. I think that's what we're supposed to do. I don't remember what I did on the normal mode playthrough two years ago, but But it was pretty cool that I did that. Oh Hi, I didn't see you there, but I'll go ahead and fight you. Why the heck not? Uh, I don't know. I think I'll just use the I think I'll just use a guardian sword plus plus while also guardian shield plus plus Well, I don't know what just happened here, but that was a weird I was trying to do a flurry rush. There we go. I meant to do a flurry rush. That's what I wanted to do. Oh, this one again. I see. Oh, man. I'm... Dang it, I messed it up. Oh, gosh. Don't replenish. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. Oh, that, that's going to take forever, though. All right. Okay, I'm just gonna, yeah, do that. There you go. There we go. I don't, I don't care. I'll just pick that up since I've been using that. It's gonna get badly damaged for, I don't know when, but I'm pretty sure it will. <clears throat> But yeah, I don't know what's gonna uh, happen for Tears of the Kingdom. I feel like it's gonna be the same thing with weapons badly damaged. I can tell. I can feel like it, they're gonna say it's gonna be badly damaged. And another thing, I'll probably get really confused with... Uh, you know, I'll be having a hard time figuring out how to 100% with, with that game by getting all of the... You know, I would say get all of the... Um, probably the same thing like this game. Like I did with the normal mode. Like when I did with this game on normal mode. It takes me, you know, let's just say it takes patience. Um, I'll go ahead grab... Alright, don't mind if I grab this. Yeah, shoot that one. And then grab another one. <clears throat> there we go. That'll, show... That'll do it. There we go. Wow, all the leaves. Everything is on fire today. Whoa, holy cow. All right, now we are here. Only one more spirit orb left to go. So that way I'll get the another heart container from places at the goddess statue. So that's really awesome, really fun here. <clears throat> All right, now we are done here for this part. Uh, wait, what was that? Okay, I just saw a shadow. Wow, I just realized I'm underneath those, um, the enemy's uh, home. Like, I'm really surprised about that. I just realized about that. Like, how crazy is, is that?
But yeah, I'll, I'm gonna have to make sure I be careful about when I'm looking at the, you know, the lavas like that, because I could feel like, oh, there's a shrine there, but it's actually the lava. It's pretty funny, if you ask me. Oh, lucky day. Shrine nearby. I'm gonna guess it's somewhere up there. Hi there. Skeleton. The skeleton of the moblin. That's creepy. So just keep climbing up. Like, even though it looks like Link is running. Alright. But yeah, you can see the Divine Beast up there. Now it's glowing red since it's nighttime. Yeah, there we go. This is the Divine Beast I'm talking about. It's what we're going to be taking on. Oh, we got ourselves like a Blood Moon coming. Which, I'm going to store. I'm going to skip that. Uh, I'll skip the cutscene since we already seen it twice. Uh, so... <clears throat> Let's see, where's the blood moon? Where are you? Oh man, I didn't get to see it. Okay, well, just a cutscene like that, but... <clears throat> I don't remember how many days um, it does this, but, but I remember it's something like that. Alright, we got ourselves a... Okay, we got ourselves a fire keys, which I have to be... We have to be, I have to be careful about that. Ah, there it is. This is the s lucky day. Found the Zikasho Shrine. Yeah, I'll probably have to get more arrows from, from the beetle. Alright, I'm going to switch to use a Hallian Shield. Since I'm going to be the Tunic of the Hero set from the original Legend of Zelda. Or it could be like a link between worlds. It's weird because what Link is wearing right now, he's just wearing like the, it looks like a, <laughs> the trousers of the hero. Hold on, if I take this off, it looks like Link is just wearing his underwear. Like why? It should have been like a trousers of the hero with something that's similar to like, uh, I don't know. I would say something that can be similar to, um, you know, a link between worlds. I want to see that. I wish that would have been cool to see something like that. Um, all right, so I'm, I'm just gonna use. Sure, I'll use this. Okay, go 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 go. Okay, I made it. Let's see if I crouch. Nope, I can't crouch. Which it's a bummer. Alright, shoot that again. Whoa, don't fall down, Link. Oh, no. I'm gonna have to deal with the part with the puzzle. Okay. Oh, gosh. Whoa, bad start, bad start. Oh, this is an awful bad start. Whoa, guys, calm down. Wait. Oh my gosh. I just did it on my first try. I just did it on a first try. Look at that. That's great. I was not expecting about that. <laughs> okay, well, I'm happy about that. All right. Now we got four spirit orbs. Now we can make another stamina vessel. So before I head up to the, the goddess statue, uh, which I think they're, I, which I feel like I might head straight to uh, the other shrine for something. But okay, here we are at the South Akikau stable. All right, he must be sleeping. Yep, he is. Sorry I wake you up. Um, look what I've got. I, I want to show you something. <clears throat> I'm going to show him with ancient shaft and then ancient gear and ancient spring. Alright, I'm just going to give him stuff like these so I can have myself some more, more rupees. 
Because that way, uh, I can have enough. Alright, let me see. I'm just taking a look. Hmm. Alright, well, I think... Yeah, uh, what what have you got? I'll go ahead and take the arrow since I... Since, uh, you know, I don't, I don't have enough which I used to. I want to have a war, like, if I have a, over a hundred. We got that. Uh, okay. I'm gonna start cooking. I'm gonna start cook up uh, these. All right. Yeah. All right. Just check in. <laughs> Not that great for the weather temperature for the cold. All right. So since I'm close, I think I'm close to something. All right, let me take a look. I am sure over there is when I can find a shrine. Or maybe... Hmm. Ah, yes. There it is. It's right there. That's going to take a lot, a, lot, a lot of way to get over there. But... Oh, you know what? Let's worry about that later. I want to... Let's see. I think I'll head... Uh, hmm. I think I should... Uh, grab a Pona to ride to help me make myself way to the, uh, I would call it Death Mountain, I'll say this. Well, I'll go to the Quark Forest to give myself another stamina. So, let's do that first. So here we are, back at the Quark Forest. Since I now got, like, four of Spirit Orbs. So that's awesome in a good way. Hi there. Don't mind I get myself another stamina. Because, you know, uh, I collected more spirit orbs. And I already chose to have a... I already got a heart container from taking on Divine Beast Varuta. So I'll take myself another stamina vessel. You would seek the power and here is the stamina. Voila. Check that out. There we go. Lovely. Alright. Now we're done here. L let's go, uh, let's see here. Uh, hmm. I wanted to head up to, like, whatever's up ahead. Um, but I'll go ahead and just go for the foothill, um, stable. Get, I'll just grab, get a Pona, and then we'll head up close to the Death Mountain. So now here I am back at the uh the foothill stable. All right, there's a Sheikah tower. I wanted to go up there. I know I said I'll grab a Pona, but you know what? Scratch it. Uh, I'll just I'll just run up there. It might take me a while to run up there, but I can get used to it because I played this game so many times before, and I can do this. I could get through that. Ooh, another sun shroom. Probably would have. Grab more, but oh well. <laughs> oh jeez, come on, you guys. I don't want to deal with you right now. I'm busy. Well, good thing I made it up top. But yeah, I'll be honest. Um, I th I don't know if I said it before for the normal mode playthrough. I'm pretty sure I have. Because what I remember I said, uh, I asked you all which one is, which of the Staminas are like the the worst. Uh, here, yeah, here we are at the Maw of Death Mountain. Uh, but that's not what I'm asking for. What I'm asking about is which of the Stamina are more annoying. Like either this game or Skyward Sword. Um, for me, oh, I think uh, for me Skyward Sword uh, is what... Uh, I would say it's probably be a most annoying for me. Um, same go same same thing for this game that I'm playing right now, but but I think maybe hmm I would say maybe probably this game much more. <laughs> I I don't know. I'm just I'm just think I'm just thinking 
Like, I'm just thinking about this. Alright, I'll just blow you up with my bomb. Booyah! Who wants more bombs? Boom! Whoa, that would have hit me and I would have been falling down. <laughs> Dude, that would have been hilarious to see those choo-choos get rolled over, like get squished. That would be so funny. Whoa! I'm on fire. <laughs> Wait, come back. But yeah, as you can see, this time we're getting close to hot uh, on our temperature. As you can see right here, right now. It's a good thing I have a fireproof Alexa with me in case for when we go up there. <clears throat> so yeah, uh, we're heading up close. Whoa! What was that? I feel like some. I feel like it's the lizard foes that's that that just spit me to to hit me, and that's never good. That's never okay at all. Elden Tower. All right, this is the Elden Tower that we are on. But yeah, it's hot. We're getting hot right now. All right, Just jump. Oh yeah. Uh, by the way, uh, I think there was a missing memory somewhere, which I wanted to track down to find one. Which I think I'll, which I think I know where it is. Um, but I think I'll find it after I get the map here. So, so yeah. Right now, let's get the map. Uh, let's have a Shika Tower to have herself a map. That's what I'm gonna be doing. We have activated. I know there's a shrine nearby that I might be heading towards to, but I'm sure there's the one that we'll be going to. So yeah, we're doing really good. Good thing to not bring Epona with us. I don't I don't see a way of bringing her um, here, top of the Death Mountain that we're on, uh, because I feel like Epona would have been on fire and she would have died. So, that's a scary part. So, yeah, here we, here we go. Now we have ourselves a map. So, let's see here. The missing memory. Uh, hmm. I think it's somewhere with the Korok. Yeah, I believe it's that. Uh, <clears throat> I'll put that here. Alright. Let's do this. So we're gonna head there. It's gonna... Yep, shrine nearby. See right here that I'm heading to? There you go. The air... The, okay. It'll take a damage. Alright. Good thing I have more. So let's drink this. <clears throat> I felt like I should have not drank it, but I have to anyways. Um, it's just, I felt like I just used it, wasted, uh, when I head into the shrine, but... I think I might finish it quickly anyways, so I don't see the, the point about that, but... <clears throat> but yeah, on to the shrine. So here we are in, uh, Balanced Approach. I think I'll go ahead and uh, use the bomb arrows to shoot the boulder. There you go. Uh, I think this one. There you go. Put the box on fire. Do you have something? No. Get a small key. Get these off. Let's get them off. Let's unlock this. Uh, 
All right, now I will go ahead and grab this. Oh, okay, I was gonna say, I, I did it too early. But nope, so far I did it good. Did it A-OK -okay on that part. So, we're okay. <laughs> no problems at all. So yes, let's get ourselves a spirit orb. There you go. All right, now we're done here. Uh, you know what? Since I now have Revali's Gale, um, I'm just gonna use it to help me fly up like this. Yeah, this will make me feel. That's gonna make me feel happy to do this in an easy way. So yeah, no problem at all doing that. And you know, I'm just glad I'm doing that right now. So yeah, be careful about the lava. If you you'll you'll die there and if you if you stand or if you stand at the, the corner edge of the lava touching it, you it'll hurt you. So I suggest you be careful about that. So what I'm doing right now is I want to follow the red pin to take me to where the part I can find um where I can find uh another missing memory. And it's something it's like this. Because that's what I'm heading to. And we're already getting close there. And I believe it I believe another missing memory is gonna be somewhere at the um, you know, somewhere there. You know, at the Akakawa places. Um maybe a shrine there, which I wanna find a scale, but that's gonna be for the fire one. So yeah, two things, Korok and a memory. So let's drop it here. What? Oh, it needs another one. <laughs> I'm like, uh, what? But the answer is I have to do another one. So I'm giving another one. So here you go. Yes. We did it. I found you indeed. All right. Now, where is it? Right there. Let's recall the memory. doesn't look too bad actually you're fine for now but you know there's a fine line between courage and recklessness as brave as you are that does not make you immortal it seems that not only is the frequency of these types of attacks on the rise but the scale of beasts we are facing is intensifying as well I feel that I fear that this is an omen which portends the return of Calamity Ganon. And, if that's the case, I'm ready to expect the worst. We'll need to make preparations as soon as possible. Well... That makes totally sense about how the monsters uh, respond um, when the blood moon rises. <laughs> so yeah, he was fighting the enemy somewhere here. Well, I think right here actually. And then I don't I don't know, but it explains to us how when after Link fights off the enemies, uh, I think there was something about the yeah. Uh, Calamity Ganon just started to rise up. Like, I mean, like, Calamity, Calamity Ganon just, uh, when the Blood Moon rises, uh, that's when, um, they released the monsters that we fought before. So, I, you could say that really explains a lot about that. <clears throat> but yeah, so we got that. 
now we can continue on with heading towards to the Death Mountain up ahead. I think, um, let me look. Oh yeah, oh yeah, there's a part right there that I want to go there for something that I'll tell you um, when we get to the further details. Uh, I think I'll go, actually, I don't know where I'm going. I'm just going places wherever I want to go. I don't know. Uh, but I think I'll use the Revali scale to help me get up there. You know, I'll just head that way. Why not? Don't want to, like, do not want to hurt myself. Which means I'm telling Link to not hurt himself. So... There we go. That one is an ostrich, as you can see here. They can attack, they like to attack you if they want to, or just, uh, come near you. Hmm. Oh yeah, this is a southern mine. Which I, which I was expecting I'm gonna be skipping by. There's a Goron kid here. Another Goron kid. Yeah, there yeah, there's gonna be Gorons here. I know he wants like uh what is it? Uh I'm pretty sure he wants like uh ten of of the fireproof fireproof lizards, which I keep scaring them. I'm sure I'll probably buy something from the Death Mount like Topper or Death Mountain when we go there. So here we go, I'll just, I'm just mining stuff too, which I should probably uh, drop that one and use another one. So I'm going to do that, drop this and grab that. Yeah, that one is sleeping. <laughs> Whoa, that Guan dude almost ran me over. He would have ran me over here. Whoa, not what I was expecting, but okay. That was close. I'm glad I run down there to see the, the Southern Goron mine. Like, Southern mine, I mean. So we could see the Gorons. Alright, I'm getting burned up, so I'm just gonna get myself another Elixir. Pretty annoyed that dude does that only like six minutes. I wish they can make it up more than just that. But uh okay. So I'm just so I'm just running right now. Uh I think I wanna go there because I think there's something up ahead. Uh but I wanna go cover myself there, so yeah, watch. There you go. Hurry, I'm running. That's why. Just have to wait till those it stopped erupted from the boulders. It came out of from volcano, which I would say from the divine beast. I would say, if you ask me. But uh, yeah, we're gonna be having a cutscene here, so here, let's see what's up ahead. Yeah, yeah, we have ourselves another divine beast that we're heading up to for the Death Mountain here. Welcome everybody as I'm running up to Goron City. So hello there. Uh, how do you know? What do you mean? Okay, 
but yeah, <laughs> so yeah, Link asks that since he lost his m memory. Hello there. If you talk to him, he'll give you a tour about wherever you want to go. Like, like you can go in there to buy something. You can even talk to him to sell. I think I'll grab myself. Um, hmm. Well, I have enough rupees, so I think I'll just buy all of the flame breaker stuff because why not? I'll just buy everything. I have enough stuff that I can sell anyway, so there's so I won't so I won't complain. I probably would have do the same thing with the the other, but okay. All right, let's let's get to the selling. Uh, I'll give him like. 20 of the red choo choo jelly that adds up to 200. This one's 70. That one is 15. Yep, 15. All of them 90. 20. Yep, 20. And then 60. <clears throat> Alright, I think that I think that's all for now. Goodbye. Thank you. That's all I want. What? Alright. I'm a traveler. <laughs> Sounds like he's not interested. Oh yeah, he yeah, you can talk to him for the end stable. Oh, okay. Hey you kid. I wanna talk to you. What now? Uh fireproof elixir, I'll probably do. I'll buy it for sixty rup. So, uh, give myself another one. Alright. Alright, so cook fireproof lizard with monster parts. Alright. Thank you for telling me that, kid. Yeah, this guy is like mad because I think I know what this is, what it's up about. <clears throat> oh yeah, more fire arrows and ice arrows if I want to go there. Alright, so we'll talk to Bluto. What's wrong? So with Redania run wild recently, Death Mountain's eruption have gotten real bad. Oh yeah, stomping around. So that's Divine Beast via Redania. Oh, are you okay? Yeah, so he has like a back pain. So I'm a traveler. So your name is Bluto. Um, who is Yonobo? I think I said Yonobo before, but this time I heard he is called Yonobo. So, uh, yeah, I'll find him. Ow. Oh. He has his back pain. I'm sorry. You, you should go take a rest. I recommend go take a rest. Alright. Okay, it keeps um, making that sound like that since we're heading up close to the... Yeah, there it is. There's a shrine up ahead. That's what we're taking on right now. We're gonna just take that one on. No problem at all. So yes, let's get started. So here we go. This is Swinging Flames. Oh yeah, I like where, but this one answers a question. Oh yeah. <clears throat> there we go. That's perfect right here. Have it drop down so I can pick the barrel up and put it here. That is much more like it, you could say. Yeah, that's probably gives me like a chest or something, which something I don't need for now. Um, <clears throat> I'm ready to fight with you. Woo! Alright, here we go. Before we rush, go! I know, it's not gonna be do that much of a damage, you could say. Booyah! Oh yeah, doing double.
There you go. Um, <clears throat> wow, there you go. That's actually really nice. Woo! All right, you ready? <laughs> I'm like, go ahead, take your time with the shot. All right. I'll take the Guardian Sword. Thank you very much. <clears throat> I believe there's another shrine somewhere up ahead after this. Like, yeah, I'm pretty sure about that. Uh, oh yeah. Okay, I don't remember. Uh, I think it's four up ahead. Here it goes. Voila! That opens. I'll take what it's mine. Thank you very much. This one we grab is a small key. <clears throat> so awesome that I got so many weapons with me. Which of course I won't be focusing on getting more of a Korox, but it's nice to have more Korox anyways. So this one I get 10 ice arrows. Nice. <clears throat> so yes, let's open this. There you go. It is now open. Alright, here you go. Could have sworn I thought I missed it, but <clears throat> luckily I didn't. And also be careful about the fire link. You could get yourself burned for that. So there we go. <clears throat> Sorry, I have to clear my throat. Woo! Alright. Another one down, so two more to go for Spirit Orb. Alright, now we're out here. And we're just gonna go that way. Oh, okay. We're gonna have some fun with the, the rock octorock. Oh, I didn't get any. That's lame. Alright. Oh yes, I'm on fire. Uh, which I'll put I'll put this on. Yeah, why not? I'll have a style when 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 we get to the cutscene. Hello, you. This one's a Goron here, so, um... Do you know you know Bo is? Uh, boss wants to know. And he says somewhere, like, at the vault. Well, the boss, uh, want... Well, <laughs> well, the boss wants to have him here, so... Don't worry, I know how to use the cannon. Um... <clears throat> here, put that in here. Whoa. Alright. Let's turn this around. Skadoosh! Oh, okay. Never mind. Alright, well then let's just go the other side then. Skadoosh! Yeah! Took care of that part. Alright, well, I'll put this on. The air itself burns. Car calls won't protect from taking damage. Alright, I'll use Rivali Scale to do for this. Uh, I'll put Majora's Mask on so they can know and see me that I'm just uh, one of them. Hi, guys. 
Yes, there's a shrine nearby, which I'll worry about that after we uh, help find Yunobo. Which I can tell he's in there. Um, I don't, yeah, it, he's saying like he can't get out. So if you try to bomb it with the remote bomb, it won't work. So I would say use um, the cannon that I just used. So that's going to be the part I will do recommend for. So do be sure to keep that in mind. Okay, that's a screwed up one. Here, all right, here it goes. Woo! Should be able to get it. Yeah, there we go. Oh, look. Something around Yunobo that's something that helps protect himself. <laughs> I like he has a, a bow tie behind his butt. What the heck? That was pretty funny, if you ask me. All right, well, that's adorable. All right. It might burn me, but I can still keep going. Ouch. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. What am I going to do? Monsters! They're here! They found me! Don't worry, I won't hurt you. So, uh, looking for Yunobo. Alright. Oh, so he's got the painkillers for the boss. So I used the bo uh, the cannon to help you. See, that's nice to hear that there's a reward inside. <laughs> so, yeah, there he goes. All right. Uh, I'll put, I'll put this back on. Yeah, we're good. I know. I'm obsessing with having a Link style with the the tunic along with the Master Sword and Halion Shield. It's just what I want. Really wanted it. Purple rupees worth fifty. All right. Can I open this? Thank you. <clears throat> All right, let's see here. I think, uh, yeah, another one is somewhere like over there. Which I'll probably be heading there. So yeah, I'm just gonna uh, glide there. I wish I, I wish I could say fly, but I don't see a way of having Link to fly. There we go. Next shrine that we're taking on. So here we go. This is gonna be, uh, so this is the blue flame. Go, 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 go. Oh, yes, I made it. Made it. So let's bring these here. Oh yeah, there. Oh yeah, this is gonna be the part when I have to like, uh, I think drop this one. Oh yes, there you go. Get the blue flame. Whoa, be careful, Link. Do not fall to the lava. Do not want that. Alright, so this part of what I can do is I can just duck my head like this. So that way I don't let my fl my blue flame get put out. There we go. This will lower it down in a good way. So that's good to know and hear about this. Alright. So I just gotta wait till it comes down, which it is right now. Oh! Oh! 
Oh man, it got put out. Okay, I think I did it like too slow. <laughs> that was dumb. There we go. I felt like I missed it, but thankfully I did not. Alright. So let's just go ahead and, uh, you know, keep going. I think we'll be okay without. Pretty sure I never seen this coming, but you know what? I think, you know what? I want to keep it with me. I want to use it to, to get rid of these guys. Oh gosh. <laughs> well, uh, at least I saved myself before I fell into the lava after I knocked them out, so. We're okay. We are a-okay for this. But yeah, that's a relief for that part. Oh, I missed. I'm sure it'll come back down. I won't complain. There you go. Get the blue flame. There we go. So this this won't be too bad actually. I don't know why I think it looks annoying, but I don't know. I'm sure it'll look okay. It will look fine. Ooh, great flame blade. Bitch, I'll get rid of... Get rid of that. Great Flame Blade. So what I'm gonna do is... Okay. Here we go. Yes! I got it before, before the flame gets put out. So far, we're doing really good. Alright, I think this one I have to use the arrows. Alright, can't do that right now. Gotcha! Shit, a. Yes, there you go. So glad I did that. Oh no! Whoa! Whoa! I just saved myself. That was crazy. I would have fallen to the lava. I would have been so mad. But holy cow, that was close. Alright, I'll keep moving you there. I know there's a. Yeah, treasure chest. Alright, come on. Let's open this up, see what we get. Forest Roller Sword. Not gonna need that, but thanks. Alright. I'm gonna set everyone on fire. Alright, there we go. This should burn them up. Which I felt like not all the way, sadly. Oh, jeez. Get up. Come on. Bad start. Oh gosh. <laughs> I think I made it a terrible start here. I made it terrible. Ouch. I'm about to die here like so bad. Um... Better act fast with eating. I just I have to eat something more. Hmm. There 
This is gonna be annoying because I have to deal with these guys. <sighs> like, for reals right now. Oh gosh. Now we're gonna need some distractions. Hmm. Oh gosh, I can't. If I do that... Maybe I'll just like... I don't know if ignoring would work, honestly. Because I'm still gonna take a hit. Like, see what I'm talking about right now? Alright, hurry up, get up, Link. Alright. Yes! Got it. Now we can leave. Man, that was crazy with those guys. Now we can head back to the Guan City to let Pluto know. And, and yeah, we'll see what we're going to be doing for what's coming up ahead. So I'll just skip this. So we can have ourselves another spirit orb. Now we are back here to Goron City. We'll go and talk to B uh, Bluto about this. I feel like I'm saying Bluto like Play-Doh. <laughs> what the heck? That, that was pretty funny. Alright. Don't mind I drink this so I can continue having a, a Link style with this. Alright, there he is. Hey, Bluto. Alright, Tiny Traveler. So... Oh, yeah, yes, more fireproof Alexa, please. Thank you. So, Daruk. So, all right. See that statue up there? That's Daruk. I believe the down one, let's see, we have, I think that's Darunia down here. Next one is the, the baby Guan. I forget the name, but either way, uh, you can tell from the music, we're about to have a memory about Daruk. So, I'll go ahead and be quiet and, uh, See what that one is about. saying that was a little strange as far as I know Death Mountain has been quiet for decades but if the mountain is shivering enough to send out a bunch of boulders that size then never mind forget I said anything about it Now we have a memory about Daruk. What's gone into you? How is our sure strange? So Yunopo is a great descendant of great Daruk. So that's why the soccer can even use Daruk's protection. Yeah, yeah, I can tell. 
You okay? Okay. Oh yeah, he won't be going anywhere uh, because his back hurts. We, we thought the painkillers helped him through, but sadly, uh, he can, sadly, he cannot. Ooh, got myself a fireproof blizzard. That's awesome. Oh, hi. How you doing? <laughs> uh, I'm just exploring. All right, so, oh yeah, it's from up there. I'm just gonna break the jars. Ooh, yay, today's a lucky day. I got purple rupees. It's worth 50. That's right. It is worth a 50 rupees. All right, I bet there's going to be a, a shrine up ahead while finding Yunobo somewhere at the Elden Bridge. I can tell already. All right, I'll take I'll take these with me. Why not? Since I just wanted them. But yeah, you can see Divine Beast Valverdania is just flying there. Shrine nearby, yes. Let's do the shrine first, so we can have ourselves another spirit orb, which which I'm gonna have another stamina up because I feel like I'm about to take on Divine Beast Valverdania for another dungeon, and after I battle the boss, I'll give myself uh, another heart container from it. So I'll just so I'll just uh, get that. Uh, what is it? Uh, I'll just be uh, getting uh, you know a uh, stamina vessel. From the shrine I'll be taking on. Oh, never mind. Just explode both of them. Wow, I even explode those the mining, you know, the mines here. Ew, got an Octorock eyeball. <laughs> Gross. I know. I get it. <clears throat> oh, geez. Fire keys. Oh my gosh! Whoa! I fell into the lava. <laughs> I just see it like er erupting. Alright, looks like I made it alive. Not what I was expecting, but... Yeah, Yunobo is somewhere up there, but... I'm gonna do the shrine right now. Let's do that. So that way... We can take care of... Um... Get herself another, another stamina, which that's all I'm gonna be doing right now. All right, so this is the distilled flight. All right, I think I know what to do here, so I'm gonna put the uh, stasis with me. There we go. Wait for it. There you go. Yay, I made it. That one's not too not so bad. Not too hard at all. Yes. We did it. Man, that was a good one right here. Now we could go get ourselves another stamina from the goddess statue. Here you are back on the Goron City. For top of the death mountain here so we'll go ahead and uh, just uh, make our way to the statue that we're heading to so yeah so I'm gonna get another stamina because I feel like uh, taking on the divine beast Valdania will will give me another heart container so I'm gonna do that so stamina vessel please all right there we go get ourselves another stamina now we're like so close to be getting more, like we'll be so close to be getting the full. I know I did the full heart containers on a normal mode, but this time I'm gonna do like a, the full of the stamina. So yeah, that's gonna be a, a fun one. Um, yeah, I'll go right here. Let's go. So now here we are, we are back here with 
you know, where we're heading up towards to Yonobo up ahead somewhere, which I think he's under attack by those mob moblins. I will, I will guess this. Yeah, as you can see, he's he's in trouble right now. Um, so that's gonna be a bummer, but don't worry. Uh, well, well, you know what? I think I'll save him anyways. I'm just gonna go save him right now. Don't worry, I'm I'm coming to rescue. Hey, hey, you! Why to go pick some on your own side? Woo! Yeah. Got myself an axe, so I can cut you up, chop you up for good. I'm on fire, and I don't care. It's worth it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Got a drill shaft. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I kill your friend? I bet I did. <laughs> don't worry. I'll kill you next. <laughs> I'm sorry. That was a messed up <laughs> whatever I just said. Whoa! I don't know what just happened here, but thankfully I I saved you know Bo. So there we go. We rescued him. So you're crazy strong. Indeed, I saved you again. So yeah, we saved you know Bo and uh he, Yeah, so for that, I'll just go ahead and save this one for next episode. Uh you know, just kind of want to make it short. Um, but don't worry, till next episode, we're going to take on Divine Beast of Awardania to rescue um, Daruk, to have him become a spirit. And uh, yeah, so thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all and guys enjoyed this, this episode. If you do, please do me a favor, drop a like for this video. If you are new to my channel, haven't yet subscribed, go ahead and hit the subscribe button to turn on notification bell so you all can be notified on when I can post videos on YouTube. Feel free to leave a comments down below, and I will see you all in the next episode. Bye!